what I thought he did for the team. I think I'm taking my hair down Wednesday. What you gonna do? Just gonna, just gonna wash it. Um, let's see, I may go get it. See if Lisa got it open in next week. I'm be so tired. I don't know. I just be want to go to sleep. I'd be like, I could have did this video. I could have did that. I'd be like, <sighs> Dad woke me up. Like, get up. I'm like, what the heck? And then I put on my alarm for five because I was going to try to do the dishes before I leave. It went for five, five fifteen, <laughs> five thirty. <laughs> yeah. I said I like three alarms and then I finally got five forty-five. I made some eggs for my lunch and then didn't even take them. YouTube, in order to get monetized, you have to have a thousand followers mm -hmm. and um, four thousand hour watch watch hours. But you have to have it within three hundred and sixty five days. So it's not like it's a year and then it starts over. It just goes from like today, three hundred sixty five days okay. fast. Oh, okay. But I'm learning how to work with editing because like some of the videos, some of the music that I use be copyrighted. If the music is copyrighted, you don't get paid. So. Trying to figure out the kinks with that now. Find the different songs that I can use. But like my vlog from last week was 40, 40 some minutes. So like if I get enough people to watch it. Like the longer vlogs obviously you get more watch hours. Because it's longer. Somebody may watch it. They start it. Then they come back or something like that. Oh, I so, see everybody watch it. Yeah. Right. Like just watch it. Even if you don't watch it, watch it. Just play it and let it. <laughs> Ready go through. Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Wednesday, and it is Valentine's Day. So, y'all, being real, real candid. Oh, um, sorry. It's Wednesday, Valentine's Day, February 14th. Being real candid. I woke up. I was sad in the mug. I'm going through a little tidbit on the side that I can't really get into right now, and I may not never get into it, but it had me in my feelings. It had me a little bit in the dumps, and I want to give a shout out to Misha. Misha, she's one of my friends from TikTok, and lately we've been, like, texting each other here every now and then. But every now and then she calls me, and she's, like, one of my only female friends that calls me on the phone. I have a lot of female friends that we strictly just text, and I have a few that we do, like, messages on Instagram. But, like, Misha will pick up the phone and call you. Like, I could be, like, in the middle of washing dishes, Misha gonna call. And I'm learning, I'm learning Misha. We're new friends. And, like, sometimes she calls and I'll be able to answer, and I don't want her to think that I'm ignoring her because I'm, I'm a phone person, but I'm not used people call me because they never really call but nevertheless shout out little little shout out to Misha for um calling me and getting my mind right and allowing me to vent I love when I have a connection with someone where I can vent and um where I can vent and they listen I've had a few conversations with people where I would tell them how I was feeling and they was like girl if I was you or this happened to me and da 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 and I appreciate that because you had the experience, so you are, and some people, that's the way, some people show that they care by, like, giving you, like, like don't be like me and do this or do this, do this, this, but, like, sometimes I just want to vent and how you listen, and Misha was that for me today, um, as I was, like, soaking because it's Wednesday, it's my off day, um, I didn't give a update, but Saturday, after I got home, I stayed in the house all day, was washing, unpacking, and stuff like that. I went out to go get some food, and I moved my car, and somebody tried to steal my car, y'all. They broke out the back window. So, if you know me, I deal with anxiety when it comes to my car because I'm always fearful that something may happen to me. And I don't have that fear with anything else. Like, it's just really hard to explain. And, like, now I have a little cardboard in my window, I didn't taped it up and everything, but I don't want to drive nowhere. Like, I'm physically scared. And I know that since this situation has been, like, kind of many rectified, that the culprits may not try to steal it again. But they could probably in a month, you know what I'm saying? It's just like my car is a high risk, and we're going to nickname my car. My car's name is Bella because she's beautiful, but her nickname now is Hot Commodity because everybody wants her. But I said that as a pre-story because I didn't tell you that it happened, but also because I'm scared to drive my car. So, like, I was going to plan me a little date for Valentine's Day. I was going to go to Starbucks. I was going to get me a drink. I was going to sit there. I was going to journal. I was going to do some content. And, like, I literally don't want to leave the house. I literally go to work at home. And since I came back from Nashville and I needed to get a new battery for my car, it's literally been the same thing. I just go to work and I go home. Like, I don't feel, like, comfortable going um, a lot of different places where I have to drive. But, nevertheless, that got me down for a little bit. I'm also single. 
Um, so Valentine's Day is the day of love. And after what happened to me today, I want to get back to it being the day of love. I don't want to just make it about a relationship because um, I want to have that hotel room with all the balloons and stuff like that. So I believe that I will get that one day. And while that's not my reality now, it doesn't mean that I have to be hateful of the holiday and I'm not trying to be. And there's so many people that I hate when they hate holidays. They're like, oh, this is just another way for Hallmark to get us to buy stuff. And like, oh, if you love me, you shouldn't wait to Valentine's Day to show me your love. Like, if you don't celebrate the holiday, okay, fine, whatever. Don't nobody care. Like, you're doing too much. Like, just be gone. But as I was, um, I forgot what I was doing, but I got up, like, washed dishes and all that stuff. And I was just chilling. And my dad, my stepdad, I'm going to try to find a picture of us when we went out for his birthday and um, last year. He brought some chocolate home. Like, so basically, if... Like, he split the gifts between me and my mom. So, he brought he brought us each, like, this sparkling, sparkling wine. Um, he brought me a card. Like, he brought me and my mom some flowers to split. He brought us um, some, like, turtle hearts to split and some Klondike ice cream bars to split. And and he bought us lunch. He got us some chickish, chickish churches. Some church's chicken and I thought that was so nice and then my mom came and she got me a car and I was so sad because I literally was going to go out to Dollar Tree today and get like chocolates and stuff for my family because normally when I don't have a significant other to splurge for I normally do it for my family but also I've been in my family around a lot of stuff but you just got to pray for me like please put me on your prayer list and that just kind of changed my mood a little bit um I did just do a video well y'all see it but I did a video about being in your alone era, how to be comfortable. Well, I didn't say how to come, how to be comfortable with being single, but I hinted on the reason why I was in my alone era was because of my singleness. And that even though you may be single, I mean, maybe in a relationship doesn't mean that you don't have to like forget your alone era. But I just wanted to pop in because I noticed I hadn't done the introduction. I honestly don't remember what videos I did before this. It's probably just like, I think me driving to work or something like that. Um, not really an eventful weekend, so th that's why you're getting a lot of me talking. Um, I do have book club tomorrow with Trees and Vines. We are reading, um, American Royalty, and I actually probably did a TikTok or a short, so you can go check that out. And then I want to give a shout out to my friend, Tony. My friend, Tony, um, got Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets off of my wish list, and, um... I'm so excited, and I can't wait to start reading it. Um, Friday, I'll probably be in the house till it's time for me to go to work, and I work Saturday and Sunday, and I may do, like, a movie day, or I may do a puzzle day. I don't know. I'm going to finish Feeding the Soul because it's my business after Bible class today because I just want to hurry up and wrap it up. And then I also finish I Am Not Your Perfect Mexican Daughter by Erica L. Sanchez, so I'm really excited for this. But um, this is, like, a chill vlog because y'all know I got y'all got a long vlog with my Atlanta vlog last week. I hope that y'all enjoy, and I hope that y'all enjoy this this video as always write in the comments let me know how you feel what's resonating with you and um different type of videos you want to see more and i'll see y'all later bye hey okay y'all so i went to fridays and they had me waiting for like five minutes Nobody came up to greet me like, hey, how are you? Take me to my seat. It was a couple of tables, like four or five tables of people. But then, like, I started looking around. I'm like, it looked like it's only about three people working. Why? Now, normally I don't do this. Normally I don't do this. But I made a post on Facebook because that's how mad I was. Because I was hungry. And I had a gift card. And I didn't want to spend no money. Um, so I made a post and I was like, it feel like it's only like three people working here. Like I had to wait five minutes. Nobody even greeted me. I'm pretty sure if I would have stood there longer, I would have waited longer for nobody to greet me. I had to figure out what else I was going to eat. Um, somebody commented on my Facebook and was like, girl, I just left there. It's only two people working. So, so I stopped on over to Chick-fil-A, got my regular. So if you ever give me a sandwich from Chick-fil-A, please get extra pickles. I found out that extra pickles is only like two more pickles. Um, and then I had free fries. My friend, shout out to her, she sent me um 
some money to my cash app for Valentine's Day. So I I was so stressed, child. I got me a milkshake. But I just got to my P.O. box and I got two packages. So I'm going to open them up and I'm going to come back and show you what they are. Hey, y'all. So first off, this is the cutest thing I've ever received. So first, I got a scripture. It says, it's on this little sheet. It says, therefore, encourage one another and build each other up just as, in fact, you are doing. First Thessalonians 5 and 11. And then it also says another scripture on this. It says, Truly, I tell you, if you have faith as small as a mustard seed, you will say to the mountain, move from here to there, and nothing will be impossible for you, Matthew 17 and 20. And child, why she sent me a mustard seed? I'm not going to open it all the way, but it's a little mustard seed in here. And I don't know if it's like a keychain. I doubt it's a necklace. I mean, I guess you could wear it as a necklace. But I got this from Kelsey. Kelsey been trying to send me something to my P.O. box for some time now. So, Kelsey, I finally got it. It was so cute. Um, the other item I got, I'm just going to do this. It's a TikTok promotion, so stay, stay tuned. I want to do like a short or a TikTok for this person that sent me to promote their business. And after I do the TikTok, which maybe be like tomorrow, I'll try to come back and tell you what it is. But that was so nice. Now I'm on my way to work. I'm going to eat the rest of my sandwich on the way. Hey, what's up, y'all? So it's actually Sunday morning, but I'm coming on to end the vlog. I normally come on on Saturday. But I actually came home last night and I watched a movie. And when I got done with the movie, I just got in bed. I was like, I do it in the morning. So the last clip you probably saw was Friday. I tried to go out on a little solo date or whatever. Went to Fridays and they was being ghetto. And um, they wasn't, um, I was waiting like five, six minutes. They never even like greeted me. And then I found out later because I did a post. And normally I don't do posts because I want companies to flourish or whatever. But if you bad, I just got to let you know you bad. And somebody was like, I was just there. It's only two people working. So I ended up, um, I think I got like a free um, chicken sandwich and some fries from Chick-fil-A. So I went to Chick-fil-A, ate my stuff in the car. You saw what I got from the post office. Um, so this was a short, like short um, vlog. And I was like, I'm not even going to post it. But I'm going to post it because I'm trying to be consistent. You know, do my two videos a week. Sometimes, I mean, I feel like doing a video on Wednesday. So I need to make sure that I get videos done for Sunday. Um, I want to give a shout out to my stepdad because he's been like parking in the front and like waiting for me to make sure that like I have a park right in the front. Now I don't know if person will be bold enough to steal my car in front of my house. Um, but like that gives me like another sense of safety knowing that like he's making sure I got a park in the front. So shout out to him. And I also want to give a shout out to two of my friends. They know who they are. Um, one of my friends knew that I don't want to say like Valentine's Day was kind of hard for me. Like the past week and a half has been hard for me because I told y'all like I deal with anxiety with my car. And she sent me a little money on Cash App on Wednesday. It was like, happy Valentine's Day, friend. And um, like to get a gift from like my female friend, that just encouraged me because I was a person like when I didn't have, like I said, when I didn't have Valentine's Day, I would get something for my family. And sometimes I would get stuff for my female friends. A lot of the female friends that I have now, they're not as close to me, like distance wise. So I can't like reach everybody. But next year, I'm going to be on my P's and Q's because Valentine's Day come once a year. Birthdays come once a year. Christmas come once a year. I mean, like, struggles come all the time. So, like, you understand. But secondly, um, another one of my friends, she sent me some money for lunch. And when I tell you, I went to Panda Express last night to go get some food. I didn't even take a picture. But I went to Panda Express to get some food. Um, and I went to Starbucks because I had a free... Now, I did take a picture of that. I had a free drink from Starbucks, so I got that. But just in case you want to know, my order from Panda Express is the fried rice. I've never tried the lo mein. Um, orange chicken, mushroom chicken, and if I'm feeling fancy, I get the honey walnut shrimp because, you know, that's $1.25 extra. Sometimes I get a chicken egg roll and, um, Panda Express has, like, these apple pie rolls. They're pretty decent. So, just in case you want to, like, pop up with some Panda Express, now you know. Um, I 
haven't really been going nowhere because I told y'all the situation with my car. So I'm hoping next week I can get out of my little funk and that I can go do some stuff. Like I'm off next weekend and I have no plans. And if you know me, that don't work well with me. That don't sit well with me. But we're gonna make it do what it do. I'm getting ready to go to work, but I want to come in and end the vlog and I realized that I didn't even do an intro last time, so sorry about that. But if you like the video, make sure you give a thumbs up, click the subscribe button, um, click the notification bell so you don't miss any more of my videos, click the like button. Did I say that? Comment. Um, write a comment. I love reading y'all comments, and um I see y'all next week. So we'll start the vlog over. Y'all have a great day. Have a great week on purpose. Why? Because Didi said so. See you in the next video.